We good? We're live! Woo! <laughs> Happy St. Patrick's Day, everybody. Uh, we miss you all so much. We just couldn't help but take the opportunity to wear a little green and hopefully bring a little sparkle into your day. Um, we're gonna do a really quick kind of low impact video here with a little bit of movement to get your blood pumping and then a little bit of strength, a little bit of stretch. Remember, consult your physician before starting any exercise programs. If you feel lightheaded, dizzy, or lose your breath at any point during the video, please stop right away. And all exercise is done at your own risk, but we love you no matter what. All right, Colleen and Lisa are going to start us off. Good morning. Oh, almost afternoon. So good to see you guys. All right, let's get warmed up. March in place. March. Shoulders are back. Abs are in. We're feeling tall and sassy, right? Yes. Say Patrick, stay sassy. Roll those shoulders. All right, just simple side steps. Here we go. Step, step, step. Make sure you're being safe out there. If you've got furniture or sticky carpets, make sure you're picking those feet up and watching out for that lounger. Don't sit in the lounger. Hang out with us. Get moving. Get our pinnies on. All right, heels out in front. Step in heel. Lisa McFerrin says thank you. Yay. Reach it up a little bit. If your shoulders are bugging you, keep this right out in front. Out to the sides. Let's take these feet out to the side. Step it out. To the back. Woo! I know, I want to sing too. To the side. That way we know we're breathing. That's good. To the front. Take those legs nice and wide. Here we go. Wide. Lower down. Let's warm up those thighs. Bring it up again. Come on down again. Lift that pelvic floor. Hold those abs in. Shoulders. Hold it right here. Heels. Lift them up.
you're gonna kick. Watch out for those dogs, cats, and coffee tables. Ha. Four, three, two. Now march in here. They're telling me I'm getting out of frame, so I'm coming in. <laughs> <laughs> All right, step touch. Single, single, and double. Single, single, and double. One more. Go to the hustle. Here we are. Woo! No one can see you. Feel free to smile, sing, be sassy. One more. Here comes that Charleston. Ready? Oh, yeah. Wait. I <laughs> Skate right here. Step and touch. Now, lower level, you're standing tall and just touching that foot. Okay? If you feel like you got a little more work in you, get in those thighs.
come back. Here comes that great line. Three knees. Other side. One more. Here we go. Get those knee steps. From the tippy top, step touch. Here it is. Single. Single. Double. Single. Single. Double. Again. Hustle forward. Woo! Let's do two more of those. Then we can come up from. 
That's our rule. Don't go where you can't come back from. Forward, down, up, back, down, and up. Forward. So who's on, who's watching us? Give us a little shout out. Let us know that you're there. Tell us how you're holding up at home. We'd love to hear from you. One more time back. Down and up. We're going to switch feet. Just shake out that stationary leg because it was really doing a lot of the work with that one. Other foot. Going to come up. Step forward. Down and up. Press off. Core is strong. Keeping our balance during this. If you feel a little too wiggly wobbly, grab the back of a chair when you're doing it. Do this against the wall. Move the couch. Don't grab a friend. Stay six feet away. Down and up. Stepping back. Good. Back up. Core strong. Keep breathing. Oh, I see some of our staff walking around. Staying six feet apart, of course. Lots of projects. When you guys get to come back, you might see some new paint, some sparkly clean places, maybe some new lighting. We're gonna try to stay busy. Step back, last time. Down and up. All right, shake those legs up. Give them a little break. We're gonna do some arm circles. Work to the range of motion for your arms today. We're gonna bring those arms straight up. Thumbs up first. Make tiny little fists. We're gonna go forward. Forward with little circles. I get a little tiny with my feet. We want to keep that nice, strong base. We don't want to see our arms in our peripheral. Make sure they're out to the side as much as you can. Circle, circle, circle. Maybe we can get a little bigger. Three, two, one. Let's take it backwards. Thumbs still pointing up. Nice, big circles. Squeezing those shoulder blades back as you go. A little bit more. Four, three, two, Last one, shake them out. Now, if you felt that, it's because your arms are so strong, all the muscles in them make them heavy. Let's go again. This time our arms are gonna be flat, thumbs are forward. Make that fist again. We're going for it a little bit bigger this time. That range of motion with your shoulder. Get rid of all that uh, text hands, right? From holding your phone too much. Refreshing your Facebook feed. Let's go backward. Big circles again. Big opens, nice and tall. Squeeze those shoulder blades back. Three, two, one, shake them out. All right, we're gonna take one foot back. Back behind us, loading the front leg, core strong. We're gonna hinge forward just a bit. Bring those arms straight down, pinkies are out wide, okay? Eyes are looking down at the floor, we're gonna open up. Squeeze the shoulders and back down. Now, if you want to modify this a bit, so I'm just gonna show you can bend your elbows. The point here is squeezing those shoulder blades together. You might have to listen to me because you're looking at the floor, not at your camera. Looking down. Three, two, one more. Squeeze those shoulder blades. Come on up, slide one leg forward, slide the other leg back. Core is strong, hinging back forward, eyes are back down. This time our thumb is up. Level one or level two, we're gonna raise that arm. Up and down, reverse flies. Squeeze and back down. Those arms are out to the side, you're like a T with those arms. Thumbs up. Our little Fonzie flies. A. Two more. Last one. Down and up. Come on together, roll those shoulders back. We're gonna do some calves here. Feet shoulder width apart. We're just gonna go up and down. As you go up, press down with those hands. Little isometric contraction there. Squeeze those triceps behind you. Three, two, let's go, let's hold it up here. And bounce. Woo! Losing balance. My cross knows the rule. As soon as I fall over, the balance is done. We got it. Three, two, one. Lower down, shake it out. We're gonna go again. This time our toes are out to the sides. Ready, up and down. Here we go, let's press down as we go up. Down as we go up. Press through those triceps. Woo. 
Stephanie, do you have any St. Patrick's Day jokes? No. No. <laughs> we did rehearsals ahead of time. We're live. It's good. Hold it up here. Let's bounce. I got my JoJo bun on. Right? Isn't that her name? I'm looking at the moms in the room. I think that's her name. Woo! Shake those out. That's enough of those. Let's do a little toe tap. Tap the toe. Oh, Stephanie loves this one too. Tap the toe. Tap the toe. Good. Heel stays down. Pump those arms. Tap. And tap. Mary Lee Sutton says, I'll try to find more videos in the future. Happened on this day by chance. Woohoo! They're going to be up on our YouTube page. We're going to send out those links just as soon as we make them, really. In and out. Just a little bit. In and out. Woo. Three, two, one. Shake it out. Other foot, time to tap. Hey, Stephanie. Yep. Do you remember what muscle we're working? Tibialis anterior. Tibialis anterior. Why is it important, Stephanie? For walking. For walking. Lifting your toes up so you don't trip on them. This is a great muscle that gets overlooked all the time. We're giving it the love and attention it deserves. What if right I wouldn't have known the answer to that question? <laughs> I would have given you hints. Would have been fair. You could have phoned a friend. <laughs> I'm her only friend, it's sad. <laughs> in and out. In and out. Whew. Three, two, one more. Shake it out. All right. Now that we've done that, Colleen, you want to turn that volume down even more for us, but we're going to do a little bit of stretchy here. We're going to take our feet nice and wide. Toes are forward. Hands are going to slide down. We're going to drop one shoulder, look over the side. Now letting our head drop below the heart because our heart rate's still up. Come on into the middle. And rotate to the other side. Back to the center, roll it up. Bryn, do you want to take that music down for us? Yes. We've got Bryn here. We've got actually lots of our Y families here right now. Those who are able to come in. We're gonna have them pop in and say hi to you in just a minute. Let's take one leg, we're gonna slide it back. Push that heel down. Stephanie, you wanna flip to the side so folks can see what this looks like from the other edge. We're pushing that heel back. If you're not feeling this in your calf, go ahead and take your foot a little farther back. Farther, that's for Connie if she's watching. It's not further, it's farther. <laughs> Lift that heel up. We're gonna tuck our tail, rocking our hips forward. And then sinking those knees down, getting that lovely stretch there through the front of the hip, that hip flexor. If you're finding you're spending more time sitting than normal, this is the stretch for you right here. Do it often. Um, it's going to help stretch out those muscles that tighten up when we sit for too long. You can even add a little lean to the side. Okay. Then we're going to come forward, slide that foot forward, and then the front foot is the heel's going to go down, toes going to come up, that leg is nice and straight. We're going to hinge forward. Weight's only on the bent leg. Toes are up. Getting that nice hamstring stretch in there. Drop that down, bend your knees, round up. Switch feet, other foot goes back. Half stretch here. <laughs> We're figuring out here. Filming something in a room full of mirrors, I'm gonna tell you, not easy. Push that heel down, come on up with it. Tuck that tail, rock those hips forward. You're gonna bend the knees, getting that other hip flexor stretch in. You should be feeling it all through the front of the hip, through the thigh, down toward the knee. <laughs> Stephanie's moving around. <laughs> Stay stationary, she's just making sure she's in camera. Down. <laughs> oh, we didn't even plan the buns. It happened by accident. The bows. The bows. Oh, that's what I meant. I have a bun too, but yeah. Slide that foot forward. Heel down, toe up. <gasps> Deep breath in, fold forward. Your hands can be on your hips or on that bent knee. Heel is down, toes up, feeling that touch all through the hamstring, all through the back of the leg. Nice deep breaths in. We're gonna drop those toes down, bend your knees, roll yourself up. Let's do a little bit for that upper body. Cross those hands together, press them forward. Stephanie, are you to the side still? Oh, Push those arms forward. Let oh, to the side. Oh. <laughs> she was like, I don't want to mess up her line. I'm like, it's fine. Drop your chin. Push your arms all the way forward. Pretend you're going to pull those fingers apart, but 
they're not going to go. And that creates the lovely stretch right here. Take a deep breath in. We're going to bring those arms overhead. Exhale up. Release. Put those hands in the back pockets. Pretend they're there, especially if you're still wearing pajamas. No judgment. I wear stretchy pants all day. It's a thing. Squeeze those elbows back. Good. And release and shake it all up. I believe we have a few folks who love to come and say hi to you. So Stephanie and I are going to say our goodbyes. Goodbye. We'll see you guys really soon. We're going to make you more videos. I promise we miss you tons. Uh, send us a message on Facebook or shoot us an email if you want. Otherwise, who's coming in? Come on in, folks. St. Patrick's Day Parade. St. Patrick's Day Parade. Come on in. All the way in. You got to come to here. You got to come here. Victor. Bye! Thanks, team!